Hi, I'm James from Zone 3. Just thought I'd make a short video just to show you the best way to get on your wetsuit to ensure there's no damage and also how to ensure you've got the best fit. Uh, I'll talk you through the Zone 3 Aspire wetsuit today. It's our, it's our mid range wetsuit, so it's uh, probably the most standard kind of wetsuit which you'll be familiar with. Uh, the front and the back. The zip is on the back, velcro at the top, downwards moving zip. First thing to do, zip is always at the back, so have the zip facing towards you and fold the wetsuit so it's halfway down on itself. So you've got it almost at the bottom there, the zip. Simply throw your leg into it, point your toes so it, it, kind of your foot glides straight through the wetsuit rather than get stuck in between. Onto the second leg. So using that technique, it's almost instantly coming to the right position, and that's exactly what you want. Then, as you are moving up the legs, just ensure you're using the kind of flats of your fingers rather than your fingernails, which can cause damage. Uh, the nails can easily tear the kind of soft uh, fabrics used in wet sits these days. Once you're into this position, just ensure that it's nicely tucked up in between your legs, no excess fabric, and you're looking onto the arms. I just go straight from this position, arm in, again, pull your hand through, ensure it's nicely high on the top of the shoulder, followed by the next arm, grab the top of the neck, be gentle but just make sure it's, it's nicely all the way up the top of the body, ensure the neck flat isn't tucked in, and then simply grab that zip flat and pull in the upwards direction. It's then fastened with the Velcro. And that's really the best way to get your worst suit on, minimising any damage and ensuring that it's always tucked in nicely, well fitted in the right areas.